Are you launching a new business brand or just looking to revitalize your existing business with a fresh new logo? Well, today I'm going to show you exactly how to do this and completely for free. Hey guys, welcome back. I hope everyone is having a great day. Now, today I'm excited to walk you through how you can create your own professional logo for free and within minutes without needing any design experience. Okay guys, now just quickly, before I show you how to do this, consider subscribing if it's your first time here, and that way you'll stay updated with actionable videos and tutorials designed to equip you with the skills, knowledge, and tools to grow your small business online. And with that quick note out of the way, let's go ahead and create a fresh new logo for your small business or brand. Okay, so let's go ahead and dive right into creating a fresh new logo for your business and brand. First things first, what we need to do is head over to Canva. This is the powerful all-in-one design tool that we're going to use today to create your logo within minutes. Canva is a powerful free design tool that is ideal for beginners and small business owners looking to create any form of business content from flyers, magazines, posters, business cards, social media posts and other marketing materials. We use Canva on a daily basis to create content for our clients as well as for our own businesses. Okay, so to get started and quickly sign up to a fresh Canva account, feel free to click the link in our description below. Now, it's important to note that this is an affiliate link, which means if you do decide to upgrade to a paid plan through this link, then we will get a small commission and this just helps us continue to produce high quality content for this channel. So thank you in advance. However, if you do not want to click the link in our description, you can also head over to canva.com and that's going to take you to this page. You can simply go ahead and sign up with a Google account or with your Facebook account or you can sign up with your email. Okay, so what we're going to do is leave you to sign up to your new account if you don't already have an account. It's a very straightforward process to create a free account. Then what we're going to do is meet you on your Canva dashboard. So go ahead, sign up and we'll meet you at your dashboard. Okay, so once you've simply completed the initial sign up to create a free Canva account, you'll arrive at your Canva dashboard. Now what we want to do is create a free logo for our business and brand. To do that, all we need to do is simply navigate up to the search bar and type in logo. And then down under suggested, you will see logo 500 by 500 pixels. What we want to do is select this option here. And as you can see, that's going to take you to over 1500 logo templates that you can build your logo from. The great thing about Canva.com is you have access to thousands of pre-made templates that you can build your designs from. And that's exactly what we want to use today to create your professional logo. So here, all we need to do is select a logo template that we like the look of that we want to build from. Now you don't have to use the logo that you decide on here. However, it gives you a place to start and shows you all the important features and elements you can use to really craft your ideal logo. Now we also have the option to navigate over to create a blank logo. So what we're gonna do is select create a blank logo. And here we are, as you can see, rather than choosing a pre-made template to build from, we have a blank canvas that will allow us to create a logo from scratch. However, in today's tutorial, what we're going to do is select a pre-made template and then modify it the way that we like. So if we navigate over to the left hand side, you can see templates has already been selected. We can come down here and look at all these different pre-made template types. We can also navigate up to the top and we can type in a specific keyword. For example, if we're creating a logo for a cafe, what I would type in here is cafe logo and then hit enter. And as you can see down here, we can choose one of these cafe logo templates that we can build from. For example, if I like the look of this logo over here, I can simply select the template and that's going to allow us to start customizing this logo. Now this logo has four elements. We have a 
black background, we have two text elements, then we have an image element over here. Each of these elements we can customize. For example, the background, I can navigate up to background color and I can change the background color if I like. I can also have a custom choice of color if I can't see the default colors down here. But for example, if I wanted to select orange, I can change the background to orange. I can also select this coffee bean image and I have options to change the color here if I like. I can also flip the image to horizontal or vertical. If I navigate over to transparent, I can come down and I can change the transparency of that element. Now what I want to do is come down here and change the text of this logo. So what I can do is simply click on this element and simply type in the text that I want to add. Our cafe is going to be called Cafe 89. And I'm happy with that. I can also come down to cafe this text element here and change that to establish 2021. And I'm happy with those texts. Now what I can do is I can actually change the size by simply dragging each element. I can also navigate up to the top and select the sizing up here. I'm going to select 18. Again, I can change the color of the text if I like, but I'm happy with the white. Now I can also navigate up here and change the font type. So for example, I can scroll down here and select any of these font types if I like. I like the look of these fonts, so I'm going to leave it as it is. I can also navigate over to text on the left hand side and then I have access to other types of fonts and text templates that I can use in my logo. However, I'm happy with the overall style and feel of my text elements. Now what I want to do is change this image icon here, this element. I want to change this logo icon, currently it is two coffee beans. I want to change this element to a coffee cup of some kind. To do that, what I'm going to do is navigate over to elements on the left hand side, then navigate up to the search bar and here I want to type in coffee cup, then just hit enter. And down here you can see the abundance of coffee cup elements that I can choose from to add into my logo. Now it's important to note that when you see a little crown in the bottom right hand corner of your element, for example this one here, let's say I select this element and drag that up here and resize it so it fits, you can see that I have a watermark and I need to remove that watermark or it won't look professional and I'll end up downloading this logo with a watermark. So if you decide on choosing a premium element element like this one, one that you have to pay for, you can go ahead and make a one-off payment for about one dollar depending on what country you're in and that will remove this watermark and you can download this logo without the watermark. However, you also have the option to upgrade to Canva Pro which is a paid plan which allows you to have access to all the premium themes, templates and elements as well as photos, videos and music within Canva for free. This is ideal if you believe you'll be using Canva on a daily basis, monthly basis to create any kind of content. Canva also allows you to trial Canva Pro for free for 30 days. So what I would recommend if you wanted to use a premium element in your logo then sign up for Canva Pro for free for 30 days then just download your premium logo and cancel within those 30 days and you won't be charged but will have created your premium logo. However today we're just going to stick to the free plan so I'm going to remove this element because it's a premium element and then navigate over to these other elements and scroll down. I like the look of this element here. I'm going to select this coffee cup and then simply resize by dragging the sides. I'm happy with that. What I'm going to do is delete this. Then I'm going to simply drag this new icon element and place it where I like. Canva helps us center the image and I'm happy with my final logo. Now what I can do is actually add another page if I like and then navigate up to templates and then come down and select another template. Maybe you like different elements of different templates. What you can simply do is for example if I right click on this element here and come up to copy I can head back to page one and simply paste that element in here. So what you can do is play around with multiple pages, multiple templates, find the different elements within each template that you like and then simply create your ideal logo. So I'm going to remove this element up here by selecting delete and now what I want to do is download my new logo. To do that simply navigate up to download then come down and make sure PNG is selected, navigate down to pages, select the page of your logo, so page one has my logo, 
and then click done and then simply click download now if you want to create a logo with a transparent background then you do need to upgrade to canva pro remember you can trial this for 30 days for free and that's going to allow you to download your logos and other content with a transparent background however today i'm going to download my logo with an orange background so simply come down and click download when you're ready to download your new logo and after a few short moments, your logo will be downloaded onto your computer. As you can see, my logo is down here. What I'm going to do is open my new logo. And just like that, we've gone ahead and created a fresh professional new logo for our business and brand. And we've downloaded it for free and we can start using this in our different online and offline marketing materials. So I hope that was helpful and easy to follow. As you can see, Canva is such a powerful all-in-one design tool that is ideal for beginners and small business owners. And there we have it guys, that is it for today's brief tutorial. You should now have the tools to go ahead and create your own professional logo with canva.com. Now, if you have any questions about this tutorial, make sure to pop them down below. And with that said, thank you so much for watching this tutorial all the way through to the end. If you got value, leave a like, subscribe, leave a comment. And with that said, I'll see you in the next video. Take care guys.